Hey everyone, Windows Fixer here and today we are talking about a frustrating issue. Many Valorant player face error code 1067. I know this one all too well as I recently experienced it myself in the middle of a deathmatch. Boom, game crashed error 1067 pops up and my competitive streaks goes up in a smoke. This error is linked to Vanguard Valorant anti-cheat program and it seems to be connected to the trusted platform module TPM. So here let me mention one more thing, this error occurs while playing the game. Now some people are also facing this error while when they just launch their uh, Valorant, the suddenly error appear 1067. This method is totally different and while playing the game if you are facing 1067 then you can follow this step, hopefully your problem should be fixed 100%. Now I tried this uh, usually troubleshooting step like restarting my PC, no dice. The error kept happening after half a death match. that's uh, when I in a moment of frustrations decided to uninstall Vanguard using a third party tool called Super Erase Your Data. While this did resolve the error, for me it's important to note that uninstalling Vanguard with a third party tool is not a recommended solution. Why it's risky? Might be you have the question. So basically Riot Games does not support it. Usually third party tools can create uh, more problems and make troubleshooting with Riot Games support more difficult. And the second reason incomplete uh, removal third party uninstaller might not remove all Vanguard files leading to a conflict upon reinstallation. And number three, security risk. Third party tools can have security vulnerabilities potentially compromising your system. I'm not sure about these things, but as Valorant mentioned itself. Anyways, now here's the method, guys. What you can do here, you need to download the uh, tool called this is the tool. What you need to do here, try it for free and you can download it and install it. I have already downloaded it. Simply you need to type here super. And here it is. It's a free version. In a free version, you can actually use uninstaller for free, but uh, you cannot repair your disk. It's a paid version. We are going here into the uninstaller and then choose your right Vanguard only, right? And then you need to click on the uninstall button. Uninstall. Now a pop-up will appear. Are you sure you want to continue? Of course, click on yes. And once you click on yes, it will uninstall the Vanguard. Now deep clean. Deep clean basically deep clean will delete all the folders related to your registry files and program files, etc. You can see. But one thing is uh, still missing. You can see here C program file, C program file, C program file, C program file, and then the registry files, etc. So, first you need to do this click on close, close this tool, go into the file explorer, C drive, then Windows, and then you need to search here for VGC. Just press V until you will get here the VGK boot status. Just delete it. Click on yes. And if it's not deleting, then you need to like close it from here. And yeah, all the way. Now what you need to do here, restart your PC. I'm just pausing here my recording and just restarting my PC. So wait a second. All right, guys, I'm back now. The final step is uh, easy. Simply you need to search here for right client because now we will reinstall the Vanguard to solve the issue. What you need to do here, just uh, relaunch your uh, right Vanguard and then you can just type your account and once you are here simply you need to click on play and see it's uh, the update just click on that and a pop-up will appear do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device click on yes and just wait here Okay, don't worry about this. It's not, uh, you know, scrolling here, but still it's working on background. Sometimes it's not just uh, animating, but it's still working on the background. What you can do here, just you can actually tab on it again and again. Anyways, now it's uh, done. Your games require a system restart to play. Please restart your computer. If this issue continues, reach out to our play, player support team. So I'm going to restart my PC once again. Just stay. Alright guys, now we are back once again. Now simply, um, again launching here the right client. 
and hopefully this time our problem has been solved so and see it's working fine right now uh, while playing the game uh, definitely I will upload this video after finishing my deathmatch and one or two competitive matches and if it's working fine for me I will upload it otherwise I will not upload it just because I will try my best to find the exact solution for this but if you are watching this tutorial on my youtube channel this means it's working 100% for me and hopefully this will work 100% for you too thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech troubleshoots tips and tricks see you next time